Step 2. Create a GitHub account and repository. A repository is a place where you can keep the code and then multiple people can edit and update together. So let's go and create our repository in GitHub. So we go to the website github.com. GitHub has two parts. One is sign in and sign up. If you do not have an account with GitHub, create a new account with GitHub and then sign in to your account. Once you sign in, you will get an interface where there will be a new button. Click on the new button. I'm going to name it as API Trust. I will give description as REST API. Keep the repo as public. I will add a readme file. And at the bottom, I will click on create repository. Perfect. I have a repository now on GitHub. When we are doing our code, so GitHub provides the repo URL. We need to install Git on our local computer to access this repo. Once we install Git and run the Git clone command, a local copy of this repo will be created on our computer. So once our repo is there, we will copy the URL. We will go to the terminal and I am going inside the documents folder. Remember to run this you need to install git on your computer either in Mac or Windows you need git. So once I have installed git I can run git clone and you can give your repo URL hit enter. So now a blank repository with a readme file is cloned on your local computer. All the code what we are going to work we will keep inside this repo. Git helps a lot in code sharing, version control and CI CD. Git is the go to repository for any code development. Thank you.